What is up, YouTube Tool Tubers of the world? My name is Brad. Welcome to the workbench, and we have the June edition of the monthly list of the Harbor Freight Inside Track Club coupons. Boy, that's a mouthful, ain't it? Anyways, if it's your first time here, I gotta let you know I go through these coupons very quickly. I cannot speak on all of them, and I'll try to give you the best advice I can along the way. Of course, I haven't used everything Harbor Freight sells, but if something comes across I have used and have good experience or negative experience with, I'm gonna let you know about it. All right, so I'd say that's enough of an introduction. Let's just get these coupons rolling. The first thing I do have to let y'all know is these coupons are good until July 5th. And just in case you didn't hear, Harbor Freight released a statement, I think it was at the end of April, that any coupons with an April or May expiration date are good till June 30th. They did that to try to stop people from coming to the stores or rushing to the stores to take advantage of a deal that might expire. Coming up, we have a coupon that I've always wanted to take advantage of, but I never, ever seem to pull the trigger on, and that's the Cobalt Drill Bit Set, 115 piece for $99. That's not the best coupon. I think I've seen it for $89 in the past, but that 115 piece covers every drill bit size other than the metric. It has the ABCs, the 1, 2, 3s, the up to 64s, I believe. So I'm really thinking about pulling the trigger this time because there's not much else in this list that I really need. The rubber wheel chocks that have just went off screen, they were up there to the right though for $10. I can't recommend them enough. They're rubber. It's a wheel chalk. It's pretty hard to screw that up. But we used to buy a lot of those when I was working in the oil field because when we parked our equipment on site, everything had to have wheel chocks. It was just one of their safety procedures. So we went and bought a lot of the Harbor Freight wheel chocks. Tied a rope in between through that eye bolt and two chocks on either side of the tire. Your trailer ain't going nowhere with something like that. So I have no problem recommending them to anybody, really. This little safe here for $22, $23, we actually have that. And it's not going to keep somebody breaking into your house out of that safe. But if you need to keep certain things away from your children, it's really good for that. Keep it up on a shelf, in a closet, keep it locked. You ain't got to worry too much. I had somebody asking me about greenhouses. Now... They have this coupon here for $95. It's not much of a discount, to be honest with you. You're better off using a 20% off coupon. But I've never heard anything good said about the Harbor Freight Greenhouse. So if you want to buy it, you're on your own. I just, I haven't heard anything good. I don't have personal experience with them, though. So that's the best I can give you. You got another set of drill bits over to the left. These are probably a little less quality than the cobalt ones. Of course, cobalt is a much harder metal. Those are like a high-speed steel with titanium coating. But they're the split point, which is why they're a little bit more expensive. Supposed to be easier to drill. They won't walk on you as much. I've never really had a preference. As long as the drill bit's sharp, I'll make it drill. And the electric band file for $32 is another item that I just haven't pulled the trigger on. I think I'd use it. I think it would come in handy, but I don't know. Nothing excites me about it. I'll probably get it one day though, on a whim. And let me remind everybody that you may not have to be a full-fledged Inside Track Club member to use these coupons. The point of sale system Harbor Freight has does not distinguish between. They rely on the cashier to recognize if you're a inside track club member or not so if you're just checking out these coupons and you don't want to pull that twenty dollar trigger to be a member i understand it i'm a cheap ass too guys feel free to try to use these coupons just realize that they might get turned down harbor freight is getting a little more stringent on it but i still hear plenty of people telling me that they're getting through without actually being a member and if you're scrolling right down to the comment section and say uh-uh brad inside track club is thirty dollars a year well, that's because you don't know that you need to sign up online and you'll get a $10 gift card sent to you in the mail, making an Inside Track Club membership $20 a year. Don't sign up for two years because they still only send you a $10 gift card. Keep signing up for a year. Keep getting your $10. Yes, I am that damn cheap. You got the large set of silver and deeming, deming. I never know how to say that last word. I don't even know why they're called that. Silver and deming bits. If anybody knows, leave me a comment. But $30 is not a bad price for those at all. They're not going to be anything fancy, trust me. But they have a half inch shank. So if you need to drill a big hole a few times, they'll probably get you by. You got the 10 piece impact socket set. You see these are 26, normally 32. And they have the laser engraving. I'm pretty sure these are going to be the chrome molly. These are going to be the premium. Harbor Freight Impact Bits. Now, a lot of people 
swear by Harbor Freight Impact Bits. I've had some people tell me they're complete trash. So I guess it really just depends what application you're using them for. I've never had a problem with them. I've only heard stories. But I do know those four plastic toolboxes for 20 bucks. <laughs> well, there's a reason they're 20 bucks. That's probably some of the cheapest plastic I've ever felt in my life. But if you need somewhere to sit down in your shop, here's a nice little stool. If you like to have the flaming ass, I guess. I don't understand the flames on all that shit. Man, we don't all like flames, Harbor Freight. You got a six inch composite digital caliper coming up here I would highly advise against because they have a much better metal one for $10 that does digital, metric, and fractional readings. One of my top five hand tools, I believe it was in the top five hand tools series of my Harbor Freight videos. Go ahead and check that video out if you haven't. I did a whole top five series. Pretty soon we'll be ending that series with the top five worst tools from Harbor Freight. So make sure you hit that subscribe button so you see that video because you definitely don't want to buy the tools I had already bought that I'm showing off in my worst tools from Harbor Freight video trust me trust me on this one guys but I know I'll get a handful of comments of people that say oh no I love this tool or that tool you know people just gotta understand we all use tools differently we all need to put a background of how we use the tool before we say if it's great or it's bad you know most of these tools that I've devoted my channel to are for DIY home gamer type stuff I'm not taking these tools out and using them professionally, although I have used that Vulcan flux core wire professionally. It's a 10 pound roll fit fine into a Hobart welder, and it's okay for flux core wire. The INUB or INEUTB whatever wire, it's a green wrapper. <laughs> I know, it's a horrible description, but that shit off of Amazon, that's some good flux core wire. And just for anybody who wants actual confirmation of what the hell I'm talking about with that description, I'll leave a link in the description for the wire that I like to use at home. If you drive an SUV or maybe a car, I don't think you can beat 40 bucks for that little cargo carrier there. Now, 40 bucks is the same as 20%, so I wouldn't say go rush out and use this coupon, because you can use a 20% off coupon almost any time at Harbor Freight. Which is why... Every month, mid-month, I put out my best coupons of Harbor Freight video, where I only show coupons that save you 30% or more. So if you're new here, you're going to want to tune in for that. It comes around the 15th to the 17th each month, where I go through every coupon I can find for Harbor Freight, and I show you the ones that only save you 30% or more for that month. The little sheet metal break here is something I've always been curious about, but I have not used it. So if anybody else out there listening has had experience with that little metal bending break i think they call it i call it a sheet metal break let us know in the comments let us know your experience with it has it been good bad in between will it get somebody by i can tell you something that won't get somebody by though and that's these 10 piece high carbon steel rotary rasp set these made my worst tools from harbor freight yep the video is not even out yet and i'm telling you it's going to be on there. They're terrible. I don't know what you would use them for. And don't worry, I go a little bit more into detail in that video of why exactly I do not like them. Coming up, we have a 24-inch F-clamp, a.k.a. a quick-release bar clamp. Now, let me tell you, these clamps are not too bad in the smaller sizes. Yes, I've had threads strip out on them. Yes, they haven't performed as good as a Bessie. But they are lifetime warranted. So anytime threads strip out in the smaller ones that I do recommend, I just throw them in my truck bed. I, I warranty them whenever I happen to be passing by. But what I want to clarify is I wouldn't suggest those F clamps past 18 inches. They just have too much bend in them. The bar is just not stiff enough in my opinion. I think after 18 inches you might as well jump up to the aluminum bar clamps that they have and they do have a few coupons for those I just hadn't got to speak on them as we've been going. I do have quite a few of those and they're okay. And that brings us to the end of the Harbor Freight Inside Track Club coupons for the month of June 2020. I hope it helped save you some money, maybe helped you steer clear of some products or pull the trigger on some products that you've been thinking about but just weren't too sure about. I'm also going to add a few of the 20% off and other product coupons that I think you might find useful. And as always, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button right there, and we'll holler at you next time. Peace!